The matter here, is that in these cases, especially for men, it is better for him to be turned down by their interest. It may seem Kierkegaard turned down Olsen here, but in my opinion, it was the other way around. An experience for a man to be turned down by a woman, is a godlike event for them. In these cases, the woman who turns down the man, is a lot more living animal-like than the man. This is an important chance for the woman to look back and think. Many women may have a period of time when they are young and beautiful, and are in center of attention, but those are the times to think themselves over. These are when, although it seems the opposite, the woman is more closer to a living animal, and the man to God. So if the woman is to think of herself as beautiful and godlike, her life could fall apart in the future. One should really be careful when many seems to love you and flirt with you. If they are to think of themselves as beautiful and attractive, they could take the wrong path down the road. The man, especially if he is with low chance of winning his interest's attention, he doesn't actually love or has fallen for the woman he think he is affection for. In my opinion, he is merely holding love for a fantasy figure he has created inside his mind, or maybe even himself. Of course, the man will be saddened by being turned down, but through that experience, he can learn how small and unworthy he is, and come to confer himself with others in society. So no matter how harsh the experience, the man turned down is closer to the God's state. But that is not how it is seen from the outside. By going through the experience of failing at his attempt to win someone's interest, the man learns the unworthiness of himself. He would be disappointed, but at the same time, by facing the reality, he can come to confer himself and see himself more objectively. At the same time, for the woman who was thought attractive by many, it will be a chance for her to learn that they had wanted her with a sense which is close to a living animal. My though is that depending on how the woman takes, it could be a crossroad of life for her.